Okay, so March 3rd, this is going to be the update on the gun mount. We're with Dave, who's in charge of the gun crew. Yeah, so uh, what we did actually two weeks ago when we were in here, uh, we took the upper structure off the, the mount. Uh, we ended up having to cut off uh, the bolts and uh, the cleats that were holding off, separated the upper gun mount from the lower piece. Uh, as you can see, some of it's rotted out. We're gonna, new uh, cleats, we're gonna make new cleats. We kept a couple of them, able to keep a couple of them. So we're gonna make new cleats for it. Have to make new base and everything else. Uh, again, you can just look, it's a, uh, looks like it's just a piece of metal, 3 8 metal put down with the holes drilled through it and everything else. What we did as well, as you can see in behind here, uh, an RBJ, we call it a rotary base junction or where the electrical connection connects from the vehicle into uh, the gun mount itself. Yeah. Uh, this was more used for comms yeah. than anything else because this was a manual traverse mm -hmm. uh, mechanism. Uh, we took that off. We were able to, Rob actually, Rob, myself and uh, JF were actually able to get um, the bottom gear that traverses uh, the gun mount on the bottom apart. It took a bit, a uh, couple of pins. You can see the gears there as well. Again, uh, it's on a ball bearing, a ball bearing base. Uh, yeah, it looks uh, really good. All we gotta do is just clean it up a bit and that's pretty much it for the, for the base itself. A few parts on here that we still gotta, you know, this has got to be straightened out. A couple of bolts that are still broken off in, in the gun mount itself that we still have to get out. Uh, we're going to have to cut some metal out, have some metal fabricated back and put back inside. Uh, both sides is like that. Other than that, a uh, few items here and there and it's we still got the front uh, locking bar that, and that, that has to come off. Yep. Uh, again, that'll be another work session. But pretty much the gun mount is down to where we need it uh, to start making, uh, cutting out the rot and putting in new pieces of metal. Okay, well thanks a lot Dave. Yeah, no problems.